and the South Columbus Raiders. Yo, what's up, Coach? And here we go, guys. Like I said, this is the big dance. These are, uh, it's one more age group over this one. But unfortunately, I've been here all day. I've been here since like, uh, it's like five something now. I got here at 12 something, so my, uh, my filming stops with this. This is the last game of the day for CGY Sports. Oh, good kick. Oh, they better get it. It's coming down. He's trying to find an opening. He's still moving. He cuts back. Whoa. -oh. And he finally brought it down. Fumble on the plate. But they're saying he was down by contact. They're saying he was down by contact. And here comes the 10U. South Columbus Raiders and like I say guys I am a Cherokee by where I stay at but definitely the love uh, is with the Raiders I I don't know anybody over there at their uh, Eastway uh, their camp hasn't reached out to me this year but I know we're gonna get it cracking next year but this is the Raiders my, my dog Mario uh, we go way back my, my son uh, played with CYF uh, one of our opponents and um I, I feel real close to this team for, for from uh getting contact with them. The oh up the gut out the, the muscle and he's gonna be the game. like I said I feel feel connected to this uh team and I've been watching them doing content on them and they're a pretty good team. I don't know nothing about the Cherokees I feel bad that uh, we weren't able to capture no games with the Cherokees this year. And I wish my Cherokees luck. I wish all teams luck. I just got a uh, connection to this Raider team. So my little man, my little uh, my little buddy Nehemiah. I'm like his mentor. He plays for the Raiders. Uh oh, bad snap. Wasn't paying attention. Whoa. And the East Bay Cherokees have recovered. Whoa. You gotta pay attention to detail. We saw that happen in the other game too. And I'm not gonna call that a bad snap. I am on the phone with the Columbus Police. As Department. it for it being high. Get off the wall, please. No one on the wall on either side of it the stage. It was uh, I don't know if it was on the side of the count or what, but the quarterback definitely wasn't waiting for it. <laughs> All right, old school wishbone. They're going to escort you out of the contest. Boom. Up the go. No smoking in the facility. Weed, cigarette. <laughs> he said no smoking in the facility. I ain't going to say what he said the first thing he said, but it was kind of funny. <laughs> Can't smoke nothing in these facilities. Put it like that. Right, here we go. Suck it down for the Cherokees. Hand off. Inside hand off to Goes off the tackle. Gonna bring up third and That's gonna three be third and about two for the Cherokees. This remind me when uh, my son Dimitri, he's a junior at Brookstone now, running back. Oh, handoff, whoa. Inside hand off to the big fullback and the that fullback got the first two. down. First down. Hey, on last night at the banquet. But yeah, this reminds me of uh, uh, DJ when Demetri used to play like play uh, came football the and the they used to call me. It's a touchdown. <laughs> me was out there playing offensive coordinator, telling them, "Hey, we should run this play." 
But the second best one of the DJ best, in the, the world. Best memories of my and life. Nobody was there to hear. We pushed it, putting up the memories. Inside Whoa, hand another, another inside hand off. A form of Titan should have been. <laughs> and uh, the uh, since the turnover, the Cherokees been grabbing five yards here, four yards there, and now they're they're almost in the All red the way zone. Fort Mitchell through his way. And they've been running that wishbone. Whoa. Tight to up, up correction. He's way coming to the net. Brought down. Flag on the play might be holding. All right, Harper. I'm watching. On the east way. Up here. And that was a holding on the Cherokees. They gonna lose ten of them on that. Four nine nine. <laughs> nine four. I've been out here so long. Four nine nine. It was nine. nippy. Nine four nine. It got hot, and I was getting nippy Come again. To the press box and claim your prize. Cuts back. Whoa. Got a lot of green up there. If he can scratch it out. Get around that end. Woo. And he's brought down. That might be enough. Okay. He's back to the original line of scrimmage. Okay. I didn't see the other one. That's the first down. So he got back to the original line of scrimmage. It's going to bring up third down for the Cherokees. This reminds me of them wars. He wars against Mario and uh, damn, what my man name is? The coach, damn, what's his name? Damn, I know y'all know it. Damn, what's his name? Coach, damn, what's his name? I forgot his name, but yeah, he had them whip sticks over there at the Raiders, too. I think he retired from coaching. With the handoff, up the inside, cuts back to the outside. Woo! He's and hit. That looked like it's close to a first down. It's very close to a first down. First down. They'll be moving those chains. First down, East Way. <laughs> and I want you guys to see something. If you add up all the people that are over there, this is a 10U. This is a 10U football game. And that right, that side over there is the, uh, that's the Eastway side. This side right here is the South Columbus side. But if you add up all these people at this game, it's more people at this game than it was at Carver's uh, playoff game. And, and, you know, I get it, 10U, but in time, it's more people at a 10U game than a playoff game. That says something about the culture of the city. You would think that there would be way more support for the Tigers making that playoff run, but... We definitely have hundreds in attendance today for this game right here. I think South Columbus jumped. Offside defense. Uh oh. That's going to put them at second and real short. Second and short for the first and second. Well, no, it's gonna be first and goal. First and goal for the Cherokees. Inside handoff number 14. King, King, Touchdown, King. Cherokees! After the South Columbus turnover, the uh, Cherokees were able to capitalize and put six on the board. All right. PAT. Whoa, good cut back out. Good block. Ooh, and it's good. The extra point is good. So with 5.33, Cherokee 7. They didn't waste no time. Raiders get ready to get the football. This way 7, South Columbus Raiders 0. 
Welcome to the touchdown. This Cherokee's about to kick off. Big boom and kick. He's trying to figure out. Oh, he's still on his feet. Oh, he breaks through. Whoa. He got a lot of green. Can he do it? Touchdown, South Columbus Raiders. 60-yard kickoff return. He looked like he was in trouble. He ran to a wall and some kind of way he cut through and broke out for the touchdown. <laughs> Whoa. Return. Off the rip. And the Cherokees got shocked with the comeback touchdown and the rebook by South Columbus Raiders. Okay, here we go. Inside hand off. And Come on a play. The, the ball carrier for the Raiders. Five. And the extra point is no good. Seven-yard line. Saving tackle, if you ask me. He met him right in the hole. Here we go. Whoa. That'd be enough for Eastway first down. From the heights of ball, he hands it off. Whoa. That's gonna bring up second down for the East Wave Cherokees. I just seen some great games there too, man. That A. <laughs> Shirley B. Winston, we didn't have some games out there, boy. These are the new generation Cherokees. I'm probably, look, I'm, I know I'm probably old enough to be these little ones. Not old enough, but definitely older than their parents. So I guess gotta get hooked back up with the Eastway uh, organization again. I know all the old school, all the Avery style stick. Uh oh, the little ooh, what a shot! Nothing going, little buddy. My goodness, that's that little number two. And then, he <laughs> then he touched him on the head like, "You okay?" That might be his homeboy or something. Spot him, got him again. Third and short for the Cherokees. Can they convert? Uh oh. Get a little nippy up here now. Old sun, the sun and drop, about to drop on the horizon. And um, that old hope, that's what we call that wind, we call that hope. That hope, 
swooping in. It was like this early when I first got here, but uh, it warmed up, and now it's getting back cold again. But I'm up top. Y'all know where I be at. Bird's eye view. From behind the ball, that inside handoff again. Nothing going. It's gonna be fourth down. For Eastway. Uh-oh. The Cherokees are gonna lose five yards. And they're gonna repeat third down, I think. Third and nine. Somebody hands it off. Try to get around that right tackle. Cut back inside. It's gonna bring up fourth down and fourth down. six. I can lay it, y'all. I can lay For each way. Big fourth down here for the Cherokees. Can they convert? Fullback hikes the ball. He hands it off. He goes around the right end. He's trying to make it. Oh, he's around him. Got a lot of green cuts back. He still saw the man. That's enough for Eastway first down. They'll be moving those chains. Uh oh. Come on to play. Think Eastway recovered. Recovered by the Cherokee. Let's go bring up second down. And 10 for the Cherokees. And I think in this game right here, and rightfully so because they are a little older, temperature might play a part in it. And that sun dropped. That temperature gonna drop, and then we all know we if you play the sport, when you, when you when it cold, everything hurt more. Same right side. Uh oh, go around that edge. Nine yard gain. They killing that right side. Here at All right, that's the end of the first quarter. The Eastway Cherokees seven, and the South Columbus Raiders six. All right, we're back, and it's third and short for the Cherokees. They've been hitting them on that right side, coming off that right tackle Inside, up the middle. Be That'd be enough for a first down. Probably gonna be fourth down and one. Let's see. Uh oh. Yeah, it is enough for a first down. They'll be moving those chains for the Cherokees. Here we go. Inside, and now to the big fullback. Short, if any, game. No gain on the play. On that one. Play. Wow, everybody eating two good hits. A good block and a good knockout for the game save, a touchdown saving tackle. Good first and goal inside the. Here we go. First down at the one for the Cherokees. They're running big. Touchdown, Cherokees. Cherokees were able to put together a 
nice drive and put some points on the board again. They've been running that wishbone and South Carolina's got to make some adjustments to stop it, especially going around that right edge. They were eating that right side up and the middle as well. They're going for one right here. Come back. Good. The extra point so is no good. good. Hey, Red ticket, pull out the and ticket. the score is East Way Cherokee 13, up. South four Columbus nine Raiders nine, 6. Eight nine six. Four nine nine eight nine six. Come to the press box to claim your prize. Winning ticket, 499-896. We're waiting. Temperature is dropping. It's dropping by the second. <laughs> there goes the kick. Big booming kick picked up by number four. And Skip on the man. Comes back. Number four. Number four. He's finally brought down around the 27 yard line. Return for the race. Set it down for the Cherokees. Flag on the play. It's gonna be on the start. Raiders. False start. They lose five on that one. First and 15 for South Columbus. They run them a little wishbone. Woo. Inside hand off to the hey, oh. Number five, Jackson. And, and this kid was actually picked him up and he spit out of it. <laughs> I thought he was gonna get body slammed. But he was able to spin up out of it. Go down the sideline. You know what that means. We're under. Halfway through the second quarter. Second down and five for the Raiders. Whoa. Inside hand off to the second back three. Cut back. Woo. Brought down by a slew of Raiders. Bring up third down. Okay, big third down for the Raiders. Can they convert? Kobay the ball. He pitches it off. He's brought down from the back. Close to the first down marker. Not, so it's gonna be on Eastway. Ah, oh, dang. It's gonna be on the Raiders. They're gonna lose five more yards. Okay. Third and 
11 for South Columbus. We have the winner, Mr. Trayon Day. Uh-oh, there's like a little confusion over there. With the East Way Cherokee. Okay, they got trips from the left side. Chicken winner. hikes the ball. He's looking back, he launches it. It's almost picked off. It's gonna bring up fourth down for South Columbus. They better hike it. Oh, quarterback drops by. He hikes back. Oh, he punts it. Okay, got to turn around. He's picked up, but he's immediately tackled past the 45-yard line. Okay, Eastway ball. Look, the crowd is the inside handoff. Running big. Second and eight for the Cherokees. Whoa. Handoff to number four, King. Finally brought down. Big third down for the Cherokees. Can they convert? Heist the ball, hands it off, going around that right end again. He cuts back up through tackles. He's still on his feet. Uh-oh, he's chucking, he's jerking. He's finally brought down. <laughs> he's actually brought down the original line of scrimmage. That's gonna be holding, they're gonna lose five yards on that. <laughs> gonna be third and 10 for the uh, Cherokees. Here we go, third and 15. Here goes the handoff. Number five, around right in. They love that play going around that little right in. It's gonna bring up fourth and about seven for Eastway. I wonder what the coach is gonna dial in right here. There they go. Big fourth down, under four minutes left in the first half. The East Bay Cherokees are up 13 to six. And this is a big fourth down, um, ladies and gentlemen. They got to convert right here to keep the drive alive. Timeout Cherokees. Timeout. Cherokee. Coach want to think about it. <laughs> I don't blame him. Very important first down for the, the Cherokees. Like I said, to, uh, to keep the ball going. And if you're, the, if you're the Raiders, you want to get the ball back and see if you can put some on the board with three minutes left in the first half. This is a CGY Sports production. This is the, the part of the video where I tell you, if you're a kid, you watch it, you play football, what's your team, what's your number, what position you play, tell me something about yourself. Are you playing for one of these teams right here? Question mark, or do you play for another team? Let me know what's happening, Captain. Make sure you subscribe, push notifications on all content because we do this for you. You meaning if you are a Columbus, Georgia, Athlete, you sports, we do this for you. All right, this game right here has way less penalties and stoppages than the last game, man. I have never, I ain't gonna say I ain't never seen a game like that because I'll be telling a story. I have seen games that had a lot of flags and stuff in them, but when it comes to CYL versus the other leagues, man, like CYL. What be up with their refs? Um, and I, you would think that all of them 
they're part of the, the referee league, so they're, they're different though. They some do CYF's game, some do high school game, but they don't, they don't make River City game wrong like this. I don't know what it is with CYF. They, they be flag happy. <laughs> it's something like they get the kids up there, benefit the doubt. Another flag, guys. False start against the offense. They call everything for these little chilling balls. They don't let them slide. Wait, I understand you getting ready for the game, but at the end of the day, they is like eight U, I mean ten U. Not like they middle school way. They make mistakes, but they be, be making these games. Then the, and with the eight U games, they showing up young, and they be making those games so long. I'm like, some of the little minor stuff y'all be hitting you kids with, man. I'm like, come on. They eight years old, Ralph. <laughs> And y'all don't do everybody like that. That's the thing that get me. Okay. Whoa, he said a lot of open. He said, I'm going to take it. Whoa. My goodness. We waiting on the spot. First down. I'm not so quite sure. I got to look at that again. I know he went for the truck, but Buddy got low to me. So I don't think he uh, felt the feel blunt of that blow, but he came with it. And that is a fresh set of downs for the Cherokees. And that clock's a ticking. We are under three minutes left in the first half now. Here we go. Quarterback under center and that old wishbone. East wing wishbone. He hands it off. Going around. Oh, he falls. Fumble on the play. And the Cherokees. Oh, and the Raiders have recovered. And it looked like to me, okay, I don't know all the rules, but it looked like to me he tripped on his own feet and hit the ground and the ball came out. So if your knee hits the ground with the ball, I mean, you would think that's a down, but like I said, I don't know all the rules of Pee Wee football. But it looked like he tripped on his own two feet, hit the ground, and the ball came out. So if that's a fumble, then that's a fumble. The Raiders got the ball back, and they got two minutes and 20 seconds to put some points on the board. Look at that defensive end at the top of the screen. First and 10, and there is the Billington mark on the play. Timeout, Cherokee. Okay, y'all been noticing all them flags? Ever since I've been talking about it, you see they hit it with three, three straight flags. Wham, wham, wham. Come on, man. D, I got another team that got to play. Then it's almost nighttime. Then it's getting cold. I'm like, <laughs> and I ain't saying cheat or, or or not, you know, referee a good game. But come on, man. <laughs> First and ten for the South Columbus Raiders. Oh, he's trying to and find. Oh, number five, Jackson picks up four. four he was trying to go. come off that edge and cut back in. I think he was riding up in one of his homeboys. He was riding on another player, and he broke out and he was brought down. Five-yard gain on the play. Four-yard gain. Uh-oh, flag. flag. See what I mean, y'all? All these flags. That's going to be on offsides on, on the Cherokees. But once again. How, how did it affect the play? You know, was it an inch? Was it a yard? Was it a yard? You know. They got a whole nother game left. It's already about to be dark. And that wishbone too. Whoa. And off to number five, Jackson. Mm. And the play is good enough for Raiders. They'll be moving those chains. First down, Raiders. First set of downs for the Raiders. And they go with the pitch. Run the big toss to number six around left end. And oh, he should have kept running. Woo! And he's gonna That's going to be short dog. Yeah, he, he kind of pumped his brakes on there. He could have kept, kept running. I think it would have been... Definitely got a couple more yards. Gonna bring up second and seven. Long seven for the 
Raiders. And they got one minute left in the first half. This game going by quicker than the other one. And yet a <laughs> Spread them out a little bit. Kenyatta Cobbin. Kenyatta Cobbin. Okay. The press box. He's brought down in the backfield. On that heavy pressure. And he goes Five yard back. loss. It's going to be third and long for South Columbus. With under. 50 seconds left in the second half. They really need to convert right here. A lot of field in front of them. And here we go with these whistles. Flag on the play, count them up. Might be 12 out there for the uh, Eastway Cherokees. Yep, too many men on the field. Illegal substitution against the Cherokees. Somebody gotta come off. Bring up third and short now for the Raiders. Good for to try to run it again. Man in motion. That's gonna be offsides. That's gonna be on uh, the uh, Eastway Cherokees. They broke the line first. Uh oh, they're gonna bring everybody in. And we're gonna cut to break right here. I would be nosy to see what they're trying to say. And my boy at the beach. I caught all the beaches. Yeah, y'all jump. A couple of y'all jumped. The, end, the ends on both sides jumped. Third and two. That really helped South Columbus out. They only need two, two yards now for a first down. 38 seconds left in the first half. Ball to height, face the pass. He launches it up, got a man open. It's picked up. The ball was intercepted. Wow, 30 seconds remaining. By the Eastway Cherokees. What a game. That was a drive killer. And it's like, you know, when it comes to these two teams, and, and I'm gonna get some flack for this, but I don't care. Both of these teams right here, to me, they they on the south. And the drive is really off of St. Mary's Road. Albeit, South Columbus home field is more on the south side, being a Rigdon Park. Both of these uh, both of these stadiums or fields are on the south side, so these kids know each other. Some of them probably go to the same. Uh oh, try going that edge again. It's just on the man out. But these kids go to the same schools. They might be neighbors. Go. They very much know each other. Uh, so this, these two teams are, are, are very well matched. Nobody, nobody is, 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 is intimidating anybody. And I, I can definitely say the old, the, back in the days when my son played the Raiders, that's what they think was intimidation. Like, we are going to hit you hard every play, every down. You are going to get hit in your mouth. Like, not like punch, but you feel me. Smash my football. That's how the Raiders did it. That's just, just been their reputation, their, their forte. But the Cherokee, like, like I say, uh-oh, uh, they going for a pass too. And incomplete. Overthrew it. But yeah, the uh, Cherokee's the same way, you know. I don't think that this team right here is intimidating these charities. And they've been uh, running that wishbone pretty effectively all game. And they're actually up 13 to six, so we got 15 seconds left in the first half. 
this it might be we might get one or two more plays both of the Raiders have two timeouts and the South Columbus has one actually jumped and they probably was anticipating the ref blowing the whistle because they clearly jumped from up here and the ref didn't call that and it was like a little delay you know hey okay we, and then he just took off and that was enough for the first down so this will be the last play very tight game got six seconds left in the first half so I expect for this to be the last play of the first half. Here we go, up the gut. Inside handoff to the big four back. He's down. And there we go, our halftime score is 13 to six. The East Way Cherokees are up over the South Columbus Raiders. That is a beautiful sunset looking Alabama. We're headed back to the game. The second half is about to begin. Like I said, these are our two teams. I think everybody understands what the mission is, the assignment. These teams know each other. Uh, I think from Shirley B to, to Rigdon uh, Park, maybe five miles, maybe. So they're, they're not that far from each other. But here we go. Uh -oh. Straight up the middle, excellent return by the Cherokees. They returned it to the 45 yard line, so they started off with good field position. He'll come back out there in that wishbone. Inside heading off to the big four back. Now boy, they've been putting up some ground time for the Cherokees. Brings up second and about five, five, long six. Four, east way. And this is the granddaddy of them all. This is a 2021 peanut bowl. Just in case you thought this was an average game. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, by a couple of Raiders on that one. It's gonna bring up third down for the Eastway Cherokees. And they're gonna need about seven yards for the first down. I'll be surprised they come out and throw it. But don't be surprised they keep on the ground and give it that big fullback either. <laughs> And it's getting cold now, y'all. I'm up here just to rocking back and forth to stay warm. If I do this for these kids, understand the assignment. Uh oh. And we have a pillager mark on the plate. That's gonna be on the Cherokees' false start. 
gonna lose five on that one. But yeah, uh, I don't know. I love my city, and I know our our city. We are dropping the ball when it comes to giving these kids recognition and coverage, and even the facilities for youth sports. There go another one. Yeah. Timeout Raiders. My boy Mario want to think about it. Oh yeah, there you go. Shot to Mario. We're gonna take a pause for the cause. Okay. Inside hand off. Oh, outside hand off. Number two. Uh oh. Two. He breaks out. Good blocking. Touchdown, Eastway. Whoa. That was another 45 yarder around that left edge, and it opened up, and he was a patient runner. Taking 45 yards for the score. Sometimes when you come off that break, you come out a little Inside flat. Inside heading off to number 21 and the extra point is no good. So with seven, and it seemed like the seven. Cherokee got caught slipping on that left hey, side. And we got a game. They made it do what it do. Don't play back in one by six. And the Eastway Cherokees are winning 19 to six over the South Columbus Raiders. We will see that uh, Raider offense hit the gridiron again. You got to think that they're gonna. Uh, Basically do what they did last time when they scored. Keep it simple. Run the wishbone. And get the ball down the field. Got plenty of time. Uh, and we're only eight minutes into the third quarter. So it's plenty of time to get back into this game. But you have to come up with a stop for the East Way running attack. They've been moving the ball at leisure for the most part. Uh-oh, they're gonna, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh, and it didn't go 10 yards. And wheel kick didn't work. First down, Raiders. From the Cherokee 47 yards. First down to South Columbus. Inside hand off. Just the gut. Up eight. Big nine yard run on the play for the Raiders. Ball past the 40 yard line. Bring up second and two for South Columbus. Second down two for the Raiders. Play though. Holding. Holding against the Cherokees. They'll be bringing that back. So it'll be second. Holding. Oh man, second and 12. Against the Raiders. Four. I say East Wing, my bad. <laughs> second and 12 for the Raiders. Thanks to all the parents who uh, support CGY Sports and you know who have your kids involved in sports because uh, we know the sacrifice it takes. I'm a football dad, I know. Ooh. Boom. Boom. Good run on the play. One thing I can say, it's just like every time I see a Raider tackle, 
I see a lot of Cherokees around them. So these these, these kids, they 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 swarming that ball. Third and six. For the uh, Raiders, can they convert? They go to handoff. Cuts back. Ooh, big hit. And he made it to the 40. So bring up fourth and two. Fourth down and two for the Raiders. Can they convert? Can the Raiders get them a new set of down and keep this thing going? Or can the Cherokees create a turn up on downs? Here we go. There you go. Uh oh. Inside, oh, he should have went straight. Whoa, he popped him. Woo! Gonna stop it's gonna be close. That's going to be real close. That's real first close. Down. I say it's the first, yeah, first down, Raiders. That was close though. <laughs> Good run on the play. That fullback, you gotta hit that hole, man. You you you, you kind of cut back. You gotta hit that hole hard and keep going. You would have had. Well, you, I mean, you got it anyway. Good run, but. First down, Raiders. Boom. Inside, cut back inside. He's still back bumbling, through. bumbling, stumbling, and it's almost like the. Uh, the Raiders are taking something out of the playbook of Eastway running that big fullback. They run their, they, they run that big 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 man out too. Like, hey, okay, that's the move. That's Police that's the carry, assignment. Number three. We run these the big Raiders. boys. Let's run them then. The Second and five for the Raiders. Boom. Oh, good tackle. Shoe shrink tackle. My number seven. Gonna bring up third, let's call it four for the Raiders. Third and fourth for the Raiders. Inside hand off, that's zero. Bounces in the hole. Right with the foot right in. And he's finally brought and down. That was up. some nice Over. foot work. I don't see any flags. Unless it went far. First All right, down. First down. I was looking for the flag, but it say, <laughs> I don't see any flags. But just like I said, methodically, inch by inch, the Raiders are, and they did this last time on the last set of downs before they scored, uh, just grabbing yards where they can, eating them up. Oh, good blitz. Same thing, ground and pound football, eating up clock. In the middle, going up the middle. Five Red yards here, carry, three yards three. there. Ball carrier, gain of eight, second down, two. Oh, and they gotta eat a timeout now. Now we gotta got time to get the timeout. I hate when coaches, I mean, I know he had to do what he had to do to stop that momentum, but I didn't be thinking about that fourth quarter. We gonna need that timeout. Now I think that, did you really need it now? But. That's why he's the coach and I'm the cameraman. He knows better than me. And the Raiders are playing from an unfamiliar place, playing from behind. In that epic game before this one, the AU South Columbus Raiders were down 18 points, six, uh, three touchdowns, and they, they battled all the way back uh, and were able to be the winner of the 2021 Peanut Bowl over the Phoenix City Titans. So we've seen this before. Uh, these boys are down 18 to six. We've got three minutes left in the third quarter, so they definitely need to score right here. Stay active. Play. I thought I 
I seen somebody throw a flag. I don't see it now, though. First and go. First and go. Here we go, fans. For the Raiders. Woo. Inside and up. Number three. Touchdown. Touchdown. Touchdown, Raiders. Number three, Perry, for the score. The Raiders have struck back. Cherokees holding on to a slim lead, 19 to 13, over the South Columbus Raiders. There goes the kickoff. Uh oh, trying to go around the edge. Down the far side, and he's gonna be brought down right now. He stepped out of bounds on about the 43 yard line. First and 10, Cherokee. All right, so we know. That, that Cherokee, ooh, that Cherokee uh, offense, they potent. Inside. Wow, oh, he brought down the seven yard gain, the quick way. Cherokees. Third and short for Eastway. Will they convert? Inside heading off to the big four back number. I think 21. that's gonna be enough to move those chains. First down, Cherokees. Of the Raiders. Fresh new set of downs for the Cherokees at the 30-yard line. Got 56 seconds left in the third quarter. Oop, they go with the handoff, going for that edge. Got that one man, got a blocker. Ambrose. He's still on it. Oh, he's. Keep going. <laughs> Pushed out of bounds. That'll be another down. Eastway first down. And with 41 seconds left in the third quarter, a score right here would put a lot of pressure on the South Columbus Raiders. With a handoff, boo, met by a Raider. And he's wrapped up. And put down That's the end of the third quarter. quarter South Columbus Raiders 13, Eastway Cherokees 19. 
Because y'all know what it is, man. It's time to throw them foes up. Fourth quarter. And that's it right there. Those two teams. Who won the most? How bad do you want it? This is the beginning of the fourth quarter. As we begin the fourth and final period here in the 9-10 championship game. Straight Whoa, big hole up the middle. He's still on his feet. Touchdown, Eastway. Whoa. Whoa. Now, I said it would be a lot of pressure right here if they scored. And they was able to punch it. Number two, Ambrose. My goodness. Just put a lot of pressure on South Columbus. A lot of pressure. And the extra point is no good. Extra point is no good. Hey, Whoa. Don't go away. 9.52. That was a big time score by the Cherokees. With nine minutes and 52 seconds left in the third, excuse me, fourth quarter and the game, the Cherokees are up 25 to 13 over the South Columbus Raiders. Okay, but well, this is the best of the best and these two teams are going at it. The Eastway Cherokees understood the assignment and they are showing up and showing out tonight at A.J. McClung Stadium. They're holding a 12 point lead over the South Columbus Raiders with nine minutes and 52 seconds left in the game. Let's see if the Raiders can answer back. Big booming kick and it's out of bounds at about 45. Okay, first down. Inside heading off to the second. And brought down. Gonna bring up second and about seven for South Columbus. Inside heading off to the second back through. What a move inside the hole. It's gonna be third and short. South Columbus needs to convert right here. Keep this thing going. This is third and about, mm, like third and a long three to me. They're getting crook over there on that Cherokee side. They're hollering defense. Big third down, up the gut, boom. That'll be enough for a first down. They'll be moving those chains. And the play is good enough for a rate of first down. And the thing about it is, uh, just being honest, even if the Raiders do score, it seems like they haven't had an answer for the Cherokees. Boom, right in the middle. Boom. They can do that all day. Um, they, the other touchdown that the, the Raiders made were made on this methodical uh, uh, running up the gut. Uh, 20 tackles pretty much so. So thing now is time is running out. So you want to score and you want to get up, up the middle again. Still running, still running. That'd be a East Ray, uh, little, it'd be a South Columbus first down. And you got to get a stop if you're the Raiders, if you score. You got to get a stop, you got to get a turnover. This thing is going out to the wire and it's, it's, it's do or die for South Columbus right now. It's do or die. Uh-oh. 
Flag on the play. And we have false a false start. Uh, start. They have to be focused on getting into the end zone and making a stop. And that false start ain't gonna help them out. Lose five on that. Second and 15 for South Columbus. We we'll expect to see more of the same right here. Boom, rob the gut, boom, boom, boom. Woo! Still on his feet. Uh oh, got an injury on the play. We're gonna cut the time out. With the first down for the Raiders. They're running that hurry up. They're getting on down now. Hand out for the gut. They just going up the gut. It's almost like uh, the Cherokees know what they're going to do and can you stop it? That's pretty much it. You know what we're about to do. Can you stop it? <laughs> All right, they settled over there for the. Cherokee's putting some fresh new guys on in that line. On that front four. Boom. Inside hand off to the big four back Jackson. Nothing and right there. Like it was some miscommunication. Third and eight. On that uh play right there. That's gonna bring up third and eight for the Raiders. This is where you got to dial it in right. You got two more opportunities to get eight yards. So how do you, you know how do you put that together if you're a coach? Clock is ticking, you got about six and a half minutes left in the game. You're down 12 points, so. Oh. Inside hand out to number six. They're gonna replacements. Another uh, drop in the backfield by the East Way Cherokee. It's gonna bring up the single most important down of this whole entire game. It's fourth down and 10 for South Columbus. They must convert. They must convert right here. The season is on the line. Albeit you have a lot of time, but with this defense not being able to stop the Cherokees, if they don't convert right here, it could be the nail in the coffin. And they want to think about it. They want to get this play right. Timeout. Raiders. And I know Mario understands the importance of this uh, fourth down. So he's trying to make sure that these guys understand the assignment. I can dial this play in and, and, and keep the drive alive. And the Cherokees, they came out here. Like I said, I haven't covered them this year. But they came out here and they are playing smash mouth football. They bring it to the Raiders. They're not afraid. Uh, they got that, that, that running attack. And uh, the Raiders haven't had an answer for it up to now. So let's see where we're at. Big four down for South Columbus. Can they convert? All right, this is it. Season's on the line. This play right here might dictate who's going to take the L or who's going to take the W tonight. Being down 12 with five minutes left in the game. South Columbus really needs this first down. Quarterback oh, quarterback team. keeper, he cuts Pitch back up. Whoa, he lost some yards. Let's see what they get at forward progress. That's not gonna be enough. Ball will go down, that was fourth down. Turnover downs. First and 10, Cherokee. Cherokee ball, wow. That hurt. That hurt. With five minutes left in the game, and to me, the Cherokees, not uh, 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 the Raiders, really not having an answer for that running attack of the Eastway Cherokees. That turnover down right there might might have hurt. You already know that the Raiders are coming out, and you already know I'm a thing. <laughs> These two teams, it's Eastway. You know they're coming out, and you know they're running it. No, no secrets. Neither one of these teams, they've both been ground and pound 
running this rock between the tackles all day long. So I expect more of the same right here. We're gonna open up a little bit. Just to keep the top, make it around that edge. <laughs> Guys, I done put in so much work for this. I'm gonna put my PayPal, my donation button on this one because I've been here all day for the league, for CYF. And I'm gonna put my donation in, in this description right here. Inside, hand off to the big four back. Y'all gotta look out for the cap. Look out for cap. Cause I've been here, it's cold now. I'm freezing my, you know what off. <laughs> but I'm here. Dear Lord, I'm here. <laughs> and I'm done my best, guys. I, I tried to scream that first game. The Wi-Fi down here super sucks, so they kept kicking me off. But I've been down here, guys. I've been down here since 12 something. And uh it's Play seven. Three, I'm just working on down, seven, seven now, so I've been here a whole work day. So y'all can make a donation and shoot your boy some. Yeah, they're eating that clock up now. Booyah. Inside hand off. Whoa! A lot of green! Whoa! They better move those chains with that one. That hurt. Big first down for the Cherokees. No flags. And we have four minutes and 30 seconds left in the game, ladies and gentlemen. The suspense is building. It's 13 to 25. Whoa. They're deep on that Cherokee side. They're deep on South Columbus side. I mean, this was like a high school game. I, I, I'm out here. I do these games. There's more people out here right now for this 10U matchup than in this high school games. Hell, playoff high school games. <laughs> Keep it 1K. There's more people out here now that the Carver Hat Bill playoff game. Facts. Run that clock down. Inside hand off to the big mm. full back. And he picks up maybe three seconds. Right down, at the seven. 50 yard line. It's gonna be second down and seven for the Cherokees. Second down, eight. And 340 and count. This clock is we're eating this clock up. Eating this clock up. Doing what doing what I mean. What you supposed to be doing? Y'all moving the ball, y'all ru running between the tackles. They can't stop it. You're eating up clock. Perfect game plan. Keep it moving. You heard the coach, let's go. Y'all heard him? <laughs> Boom. Inside hand off. He met by some Raiders on that one. Pick number 91 for the Raiders on the tackle. Let's bring up third and about four for the Cherokees. Now if you ask me, they're probably gonna do that end around. You get the first down. They've been busting up the middle too though. Uh, number 32 more. Number 32 Moore, the family of Mr. Moore. If you're still in the stadium, if you're still in the stadium, meet us at the bottom of the, the entrance to the field. Well, what I expect, uh, number 32, you would think Moore. they definitely want to run the clock out. We had, we had 245 left in the game. So if you're the East Bay Cherokees, you want the clock to keep Michael running. Moore, and if, and if anything else, you, you want to make the South Columbus field. Raiders use a timeout. So uh, if you're the East Bay Cherokees, keep the ball uh, short. Uh, keep the ball in front of you. No passes. Run it. And they got two downs to get a first down on. So that's third down in about five. They can run this thing down another 30 seconds on this possession right here. So, real tough. 
tough situation for South Columbus. I mean, some decent time management and a first down or two, this, this game is over. Third and five. Okay, here we go. Team captain filling in the gaps. All right. Third and five for the Cherokees. Here goes the head out to the big fullback. Whoa. And that's going to be enough for the first down. They'll be moving those chains. The Eastway Cherokees are two minutes and 30 seconds away from peanut bowl winners. What can the South Columbus Raiders do to turn the tide? Tough game. Smash mouth football, in your face football, ground and pound football is what we've seen tonight by both of these teams. Inside handoff. Whoa, he's still on his King. feet, cuts back. That's gonna be good three. for about three yards, maybe four. We're under two minutes left, ladies and gentlemen. And reality is starting to sit in on the Raiders' sides. Real quiet over here. You know that, that, that. Real quiet when you, you kinda almost came to grips like, yeah, we're gonna lose this one. Tough loss, tough loss for this team. I've been around this team the last, I'd say last maybe six weeks doing some uh, games and photography for a couple of the athletes and great ball team. It's gonna be a tough one. Boom. King Good hit. bounces off. He's still on his feet. Keep going. Uh -huh. Hey, Blue Wilson. Keep going. Hit his ass. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> That's for Buddy talking about some keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Could have got that man hurt, man. Progress has been stopped. All right. Inbound. Like it'll be third and seven with 20 seconds left. Count is lining up at the 50. You hear him sounding off. The 2021. With no more timeouts, they can't stop it. In 13 seconds, it's going. Here we go. We're going to show some love to the home team. First time the Raiders have been beat in 12 years. First time the Raiders have been beat in 12 years. Wow. 2012. Well, anyway, your 2021 10. said that is so long. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy for them. So sad for the Raiders. Oh, wow. What a ball game. What a ball game. This is why we do it. We love the sport. All right. They about to dap it up. Like I said, these kids know each other, man. Everybody know what's up. Everybody cool with each other, man. Excellent Good game. I bet they said we finally beat you, Mario. They be trying to, they be trying to beat my dog, man. They're like, if you beat Mario, they're like beating Nick Saban. <laughs> Good game, Cherokees. Great game, Cherokees. I see you popping smoke over there, Cherokees. I see you popping smoke. Eastway, Eastway, go back to your sideline. Eastway, go back to your sideline. Out to shake and that's your final score. East Bay Cherokees 25, South Columbus Raiders 13. And this is the end of the broadcast of the 2021 Peanut Bowl. Wow, by CGY Sports. We've been in the building all day. We 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 faced the weather. And uh, oh, they know that jugging over there. Get it? <laughs> Hey, hey. And we've been here all day, guys. We've been here all day for you to cover these games 
Uh, we, we saw history being made today. Nobody has beat uh, uh, the South Columbus Raiders since 2012. So shout out to the 2021 nine-ten-year-old championship game. Cherokees for that Raiders. awesome feat. Hand, and shout out to the Raiders on an awesome season. This 10U team, man. Like I said, I know these guys. They put so much into these young folks, and wow, great game. one more football team left we will start transitioning to basketball so if uh, you do AAU or any kind of other basketball and you want to uh, book us hit me up guy like I say um, this is how I pay my bill no disrespect to nobody so just pull them up just to pull up I don't I don't do that if I pick a game you want to go there because I want to go there that's, that's just what I do. But if you need my services, inbox me, hit me up. It's the host of the most from coast to coast. And thank you for thank you, Columbus. Thank you to the athletes. Thank you to all my supporters. Thank you to to, to the parents for another great year in youth football in Columbus, Georgia. Ooh.